Come on, Tom. Hello, Tom. <laughs> it was just a joke, man. Come on, a little plastic wrap, really? <laughs> Where you got your head? Tom. Get your headphones on, bruh. Come on, man. I need a ride to go get the fan mail today. I don't have a car. Probably could've... All right, <laughs> see yourself. I'll be out in the RV if you change your mind. Hey there, Jay. This is your old pal, which you're gonna see here. I'm going to pick up the fan mail. Tom, little fucker, he's on his computer. He's got his headphones on. He just wants to ignore me. Hey there, Jay. Zero Power Giants here. I don't know if I opened that up or not yet, um, but I'm gonna go get fan mail. Tom doesn't want to fucking drive me. I'll just take his car. Real quick, it's right around the corner. Catch you back with you guys later. Just a lovely day in the Wingless Eagle. It sounds like a freaking bar or something. Uh, I just got done doing fan mail, as you can see. Jesse made it a little messy. Uh, there's some good stuff in here. I don't. I wish I had a trash can in here or something. Um, I hate how long. I'm sorry the upload was so late, guys. I didn't get it till like, 5 p.m. Now I'm starving. I think it has a lot to do with Uncle Larry's internet being shiitake. Um, I'm getting, like, maybe two of the, you know, the lines, like, little line, bigger line, bigger line, the wave, the shock wave. I only had a couple of them, so. Yeah, glad I got that out to you guys. I'm fucking, I haven't eaten anything all day. So, let's go check on Uncle Larry. Tom already left for college. I kind of wanted to maybe play some vid games with him tonight. Maybe I'll just uh, hop on his Wii U. I'm sure he won't mind. Maybe I'll unlock some stuff for him. Because he's, uh, he's a little pissy with me. Cause, uh, I think it's just because it's a prank. I don't know. The boy doesn't get out much. I think. I think I spooked him. I was trying to, I don't know. That's just what I'm used to, is pranks and stuff. And I guess he's not really familiar with that. I mean, the whining. Huh? I can come in? Oh. Sorry, I used to knocking. What's up? How much? Oh, I hate the news. Depressing as shit. Good thing, How you doing, my darling? This is a little Russian voice, wasn't it? Yeah. Oh. That's a nice meow. Is it that nice? I don't know. Is that nice meow? You never know with her. So, got anything good around here to eat? I'm fucking we starving. Already, we already ate. Alright. Garfinkel, you hungry? Take a little trip out to the kitchen? What's your, where's your happy spot? Down here? There it is. That's where the tumor is. Jesus Christ. I'm gonna get something to eat. What'd you guys have? Ooh, Jesse Likey. We got. Is there? There's some. Oh, here you go. Yeah. Can I have some of this chicken too? Really? I mean. Yeah, it's rotisserie, right? Yeah. Foop, yeah. I mean, we're gonna have to talk. Right? Hmm? We gotta talk. What? Yeah. What's up? Well, for one, I talked to your mom today. All right. Yeah. And uh, if it's about the shirts, uh, it's. I mean, we can talk about it another time. I'm, I just need to get something to eat before I get really pissy. You know. Well, I just want to say that your mom is all right with this whole thing. You got silverware somewhere? Yeah, you know where it's at. It's in the drawer. She's all right with the whole thing, so I just want you to know that my mom's okay with that shit. Yeah, she is. So the t-shirt thing is going to happen. It's going to happen. It's going to happen. Right. Uh, it's a business thing from what the standpoint that I told uh -huh. you. It's a business thing. It has nothing to do with between. But it has everything to do with it because it's my business. It's my shop. It's, it's my good, shirt. No, it no, is no, my business. No, no. You're a customer of our business. Who? I'm a customer, right. Yes. So, I mean, I could take my business elsewhere. I could find somebody else to you sell sure my shirt. Could. You know, we've been in business since 1976. You haven't, weren't even born in 1976. So, it's like. Right. That's I really don't want to talk about this right now. All right, well, let's go on to the Can I get some of the food in my stomach? No, Where's wait, the plates wait, wait at? Second. Where's the plates right at? I want to talk to you about Can I eat? I just want to eat. Where's the plates? There's, you know where the plate? There's paper plates in there. Second of all... I'm going to grab a water, too. Second of all, 
Are you gonna listen? Right. No, I'm listening. I told you, this is food. Second of all, the dad called me today. Okay. And I talked to him. Is this why you're so angry right now? Well, what did he say? I've been angry for what did my dad say? Your dad doesn't want you here. Well, no shit. I mean, it's but the same thing. He... Exactly. Last time. I'm gonna use one of these. But you have to understand my standpoint now. It's like there is a wedge being driven between me. It's your the mom. same shit that has always been happening. No. no I mean, no. I don't... No, what did he say to you? I'm gonna tell you what I feel right now. All okay. Right? This is me now. Right. I really want you to find another place to stay. I really do. And let me tell you the third thing. That I'm really, this is the thing that I'm pissed off about, Jess. Uh huh. What did you do yesterday? I watched the video today of yours. Oh, what did you do I don't, yesterday? I, um, I don't know what I, 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 I forget every single day because I'm, I'm constantly see. making videos. I don't remember what I filmed. You took my son to go prank your brother. N no. No, I, I needed to get home to get stuff. I was going to ask you, but you're playing basketball. Did you do that every Sunday? So I asked Tom, and Tom helped me. First of all, I watched the video. Okay. You lied to Tom and said that I was going to uh, take you over there. You never I ended up telling I told him the truth eventually, and it was just a harmless prank. I have nothing to lose. No, but now you involve Tom in this whole shit. He hardly was involved. He literally just put his finger on the plastic wrap and then filmed it. But you... He, he has nothing to do with this. Now, how am I supposed to protect Tom when I'm at work and Jeffrey comes over here to do something to Tom? He's not going to do it. He knows it was me. He has no idea Tom was involved. And if you watch the video, it's not a big deal. Tom didn't he, do anything. How does he not know? Hold on. Shit. I, I don't see why you're so fired up about that. What did my dad say to you to get you like this? My, all your dad said to me was is that he doesn't want you here. And, and Jesse, right. I have to agree with him to a certain point. All right, well, then, then I, that, can just, that can just stay there. I'm, I'm not hungry to... anymore. I'm pissed off. Why are there, ugh, this, you Listen to me. Yeah, I'm listening. You haven't really been saying much. I haven't been saying much. Or I haven't All I hear is my today. dad. All I hear is my dad right well, now. You want take, me out of here? No, let's not take it. You want me out of here? I want you to find another place to stay. <laughs> Look, you can just say it, all right? I'm not going to be offended. I've had this happen to me before. I just figured it no. wouldn't come from you. No, because I'm not kicking you out of that. I, I just came. I literally just you. I just came out of the house because you're literally forcing me out right now. I'm not literally forcing you out. I am telling you that I just would like you to find another place. Just okay, why? Of, what is this about, really? What is it? What is it, my dad? Is it no, because of the shirt for, thing or is it because of Tom? It's for the sake of the whole family. What? There's a rip being... Drawn right now. This is like that when I was living in tents out there. What has changed? You're, it's your mom. Your mom is not happy with this. And and I stand behind your mom 100%. Yeah, I I generally do too, but I, I don't think she's right here. Well, Especially I like, I mean, my mom would say that she doesn't want me here. She, she doesn't want you to be homeless. Nobody wants you to be homeless. What we're saying, asking you is that because of the problem between your dad and I right now, that things would be better if you could find a separate place right now. That's what we're saying. I don't have a separate place. I mean, this is really all I have. There's a reason I came right here afterwards. For whatever I was living in a fucking tent a few months ago because I had nowhere else to go. There's not one possibility of any place for you to stay. I could, I could call my friends, but you have you to understand. Have no you have no money saved up that you can't get a place. I just finished paying off my debt, and I just finished paying off my dad's fucking rent for the month, and then I also bought these consoles to give away to my fans. This is all I have. I mean, I mean, the I could call my friend. I could call my friends, but you have to understand, they fucking, they all live with their parents too, and that brings them all in it because apparently, I just fucking bring everyone down with me. No, that that's what you said the other night. Are you taking it back? What the hell's all this stuff? That's fan mail from today. So who's gonna clean this shit up? Me? I mean, I don't know. There, there wasn't any trash here, and my spleen hurts, so I, I didn't feel Your like. Spleen? That's all I ever hear is like this, that, and the other thing with that. But I mean, it's like. You sound like my dad right now. You saying it's fake? You saying it's a fake illness? No, I no, I'm not saying it's a fake illness. Okay. I know, I know for a fact it's real. Right. And you know that. Yeah, oh, fuck, I, I'm serious. Like sometimes it's a convenient excuse not to do anything uh, sometimes. <laughs> I'm not... Oh, man, Jesse, I don't I'm want... I'm packing up. Why are you saying all this if you don't want me out? Tell me how you're really you feeling. It's obvious. I don't want you out, except for the reason that I can't have this turmoil between the family. I can't. 
It's already there. It's going to be there whether I'm here or not. I understand that, but you took, you brought my son into this who never belonged into this ever. He was, he was hardly involved. And, now, and it got him out of the house and, for once, and I figure that's a good to thing. To tell you the truth, Jess, you want me to tell you the truth? Yeah. I don't know that I trust you. You went and got my son behind my back to go help you with something by lying to him. That's the God's honest truth. You don't want someone staying on your property. You can't trust them, right? So what do you want? I'll just leave all this here for you to clean up anyway. Yeah, obviously. I'll clean it up. Maybe you can even keep some of it. Yeah, because that's what I want. You can have my play button, too. I'm not, I don't need that. I don't want your play button. I don't want it to end like this either, Jess, because I'm on your side. I don't know why you think I'm not on your side. I'm just walking. I'm going. Can't you make sure... Uh, make sure that you find some place. Come on, I want you leaving just... I have my cell phone. I got a decent amount of battery left. I can make some calls. I don't know who the fuck's going to actually listen. Because, I mean, I would have stayed with a friend before you last time. But the... What, what, all I'm asking right now is that you just try to get a hold of somebody. I'm not asking you for the rush and go get your stuff and run out. I know what I'm not wanted. It's the same shit with my dad. You turn into my dad. I'm not turning into your dad. I'm listening. All I hear is you want me out. And you know what? Here. No. No, you know what? Hey, here's your fucking RV key. Thanks. I've always been on my own. Hope I don't get hit by a car out here. It's a pretty busy road. I'm just going to start walking this way. Really? This is your last chance. You don't care? No, I do care. You're the one walking away, not me. I'm standing right here. You're the one that walked out there, not me. Whatever. Yeah, drink some more Corona. We're just gonna keep walking, Juggies. I got my stuff. Start making some calls. So fucking cross the street. I'm just gonna fucking stay out in the road. People pass me looking at me fucking weird. Jesus Christ. Alright. Alright. Okay. Fuck. Fucking even Uncle Larry fucking kicked me out. I'm gonna start making some texts, making some calls. See if somebody will. Jesus Christ. You know what, Juggies? I figured, fuck it. My house isn't far, so maybe like a mile. If I just keep walking, I'm just gonna walk back to my house and hope for the best. I really got nowhere else. Fuck, I'm getting tired, Juggies. Holy shit, that sun's bright. Well, I mean, this is hopeful. Right? Oh god, the sun's setting. I can't fucking believe this shit. Whew. Fuck. Fuck. I can't make it. 
fuck, let me turn around for you guys. Ah, it's sun. I can't make you guys. My fucking spleen's killing right now. Mono's kicking up. Too much yelling, too much walking, carrying this shit. Got like 20 t-shirts in this bag. Well, if there ever was a time where I was officially fucking stranded, it'd be right now. I'm gonna end this vlog for you guys. I'm gonna start getting on my phone, calling anyone. Maybe I can get a fucking ride at least to some motel or hotel. Probably not around here. These bumbled fuck. Alright, Jays. Don't forget to subscribe for more content. Twitter, Instagram, links in the description. I fucking love you, Jays, to death. Don't forget. Keep it rigid.